What's going on guys? You're checking out QG and HQ. I am your host Chris and in today's video we're checking out the brand new 4K 360 Fly camera. Not only does this camera look really cool, but it's absolutely awesome. I mean, you've seen this thing on, you know, planes. I've seen it on on cars, I've seen it on motorcycle helmets, I've even seen it on surfboards because it is a waterproof camera. It is Bluetooth, Wi-Fi, ready to go. Uh, absolutely awesome camera. You know, it's just, it's a lot of fun. So today we're going to be looking at the camera itself. We're going to be checking out what comes in the packaging as well as how responsive the app works with some footage that I'm going to record through my app. Um, and then we're going to also, in the future, do some footage with this thing over the next week. So stay tuned for that. Uh, other than that, I mean, I, it kind of reminds me of a plasma grenade from Halo. Right? That's not just me, right? All right, guys, let's get into it. So jumping right into it, the first thing I have to talk about is the packaging on this item. I think it's absolutely awesome the way this even looks. If you see this on the shelf, you'd have to come over and see what this camera's about. It really does look cool. On the back, it tells you more about the camera. It's 360 4K video. It has new 16 megapixel image sensor, live streaming, front facing mode, time lapse mode, GPS, motion and audio detection. They really cut no corners when making this 4K camera. Hopefully it lives up to its name. So the first thing you agree with underneath the camera itself is this small little booklet that contains everything from directions on how to use the camera to your warranty. And they went ahead and threw in some stickers, the two 360 stickers with their green fly logo. The next thing you have underneath that is the USB charging cable to obviously power the unit itself. Next up included inside the package, they give you a protective case for the camera itself, which I think is an awesome add on inside for the fact that now I don't have to go out and spend any extra money. When I'm done using the camera, I have a place to put it. So their logo is go anywhere, mount anywhere. And if you guys are a GoPro fan, you know what this is. This will attach to any GoPro accessory on the market to date, which is a really cool add on. Then you have the charging dock, which is fully magnetic. Now the camera itself comes in at 172 grams in weight. It has an hour and a half of battery life for recording and about a standby battery up to 14 hours if you want to travel. It's definitely a unique looking camera. You really don't see something like this. If you do see it, you definitely want to get your hands on it and play with it. It's really, really cool looking. So it sits on top of the dock super easily. Like I said, it's fully magnetic. Just give it a twist and it'll click on and you're all set and ready to go to charge it. So this being their top of the line brand new 4K camera, the price is pretty steep coming in at $499.99 USD. If that's too much for you guys, you don't want to hop in that 4K train, you can get an HD version for about $200. So this is an old mount I found laying around just to show you guys again how easy it is to attach to anything. Now connecting to your phone is even easier. Hit the button, it'll blink blue a few times and when it finds a connection, it'll turn a solid blue and vibrate. This will connect to any iPhone or Android on the market today. It's really easy to use. And the app itself is super fluid. This is me not recording anything, just testing it out and looking around. Uh, full 360 view, it's really, really different. There's you know, not a lot of cameras that you can get your hands on that will do this type of stuff. So it is really, really fun. Now, in the beginning, I did have some connectivity issues with the app for the first 15 minutes. But after that, it just kind of worked its way out and I never had a problem since. I don't know what that was about. Could have been my internet, but you never know. And like I stated before, it is super easy to navigate through. You can go ahead and change the saturation, even the brightness of the camera itself. It has a video recording rate of 50 megabytes per second and a max video resolution at 1728 by 1728 at 60 frames per second. This camera is also waterproof, so you guys go ahead and throw it on you know, your surfboard, throw it in your fish tank, your toilet, whatever you guys wanna do, the possibilities are endless. So when you record, the light will turn red. This is me in live time, you know, checking out my entire room as I'm recording, which is really cool. When you're done recording, just hit the uh, stop button. It will go ahead and save to their database where all your other videos are saved. You could then email them to yourself, upload them to YouTube, things like that. Uh, there is a microphone on this thing. It is a stereo mic, so it will pick up sound if you wanted to. Things absolutely awesome. So, I mean, these 360 videos are brand new on the market. Do you guys think they're worth it? You think it's just kind of like a fad, something that's going to go away really quickly? Let me know what you guys think. Is this camera even worth it? Who knows? You let me know. Give the video a thumbs up if you liked it. Subscribe, and do not forget, you guys are awesome.